Now he's just gonna, just gonna be like, oh, okay, I'm done. You can go on now. So, um, real fun fact. He, uh, you see, you're supposed to go into the door and then go on to the final cutscene. But here's a really fun glitch right over here. Should be here, right? Don't tell me they patched it. They patched the glitch out. Aww. Oh, nope, there we go. Ha! Come, you whip. It is easy. Take the icon in your hands. And do as you are told. Please use caution. This reclaimer is delicate. One more word, Oracle, and I rip your eye from its socket. Mm. It is nothing compared to what I'll do to you. Carteris, stop. Put down the icon. Put it down. And disobey the Hierarchs? There are things about Halo even the Hierarchs do not understand. <laughs> Take care, Arbiter. What you say is heresy. Is it? Oracle, what is Halo's purpose? Collectively, the Seven? Wrong! Not another word! Please. Don't shake the light bulb. Yeah, you saw what was in the background. If you want to keep your brain inside your head, I tell those boys to chill. Go ahead. Do your thing. The sacred rings, what are they? Weapons of last resort, built by the forerunners to eliminate potential flood hosts, thereby rendering the parasite harmless. And those who made the rings, what happened to the forerunners? After exhausting every other strategic option, my creators activated the rings. They and all additional sentient life in free radii of the Galactic Center died as planned. Would you like to see the relevant data? Tartarus, the prophets have betrayed us. Ow! Arbiter, the great journey has begun, and the brutes, not the elite, shall be the prophet's escort. That had to hurt. Fucking metal ball being in your face. Or getting hit in the face by a metal ball. I don't remember the last Halo doing all of that when it was activated. Then again, it wasn't activated. Oh, hey! Sword Elites. So, uh. Bastard! Yeah! How long do you the glitch brings a ba the Banshee into the final fight. Now I'm not gonna beat him like that. I'm just gonna put. I'm gonna do one really fun thing that I love to do, just so you guys get a little bit of amusement out of it. Uh, let's see if I can get him over here. I have no idea what just happened. Alright, we're gonna try this again. And, uh, not fail this time. Not including that fail. I don't I, I think I touched, like, a death barrier with the Banshee. Because you're not supposed to be able to bring this Banshee in the final fight after all. He can't hurt you. He can damage the outside of the Banshee, but he can't hurt you. We'll shut them down. Then how do I stop? Ooh. It will take some time to go over the top of the Quick dollar. I would suggest the reclaimer send the Johnson, I'm on it. Hang tight, ma'am. Not until that brute is dead. Oh. 
Come on, douchebag. I just want to push you off the edge. Where'd these guys come from? Close. You're telling me you can't stop the sequence. Give me a direct answer. I am God damn it, come on! Hey! Oh, how's that feel? Are you I am damaging him a bit. But I just wanna push him off. <laughs> I just won't die. There, fine. That works. Where's the banshee go going? No, Banshee! I was gonna make you in the final cutscene! That was a very big explosion. There's no way anything survived. That was supposed to be able to survive that. That should have like blown a hole in the freaking high charity. Oh well. What's that? A beacon. What's it doing? Communicating at superluminal speeds with the frequency. Communicating of with what? The other installations. Show me. Failsafe protocol. In the event of unexpected shutdown. The entire system will move to standby status. All remaining platforms are now ready for remote activation. Remote activation? From here? Don't be ridiculous. Listen, Tinkerbell, don't make me... Then where? Where would someone go to activate the other rings? Why the Ark, of course. And where, Oracle, is that? One month later. Unknown classification. It isn't one of ours. Take it out. This is Spartan 117. Can anyone hear me? Over. Isolate that signal. Master Chief, do you mind telling me what you're doing on that ship? Sir, finishing this fight. And that was the end of Halo 2. What a tease, right? A lot of people didn't like it. Because of that cliffhanger ending, but I mean, what could else? What else could they have done? In a series like Halo 3, it's better to play Halo 1, Halo 2, and Halo 3 all in nice succession. You know. So I don't. I'm not going to complain about the cliffhanger ending. Uh, credits. You want to show up now? Credits. No. Okay. Well, since the credits aren't going to show up. I'll just keep on talking. In fact, I think the game crashed on me. I think the game crashed on me. Uh, whatever. Well, my opinion is that was my Halo 2 LP. Thank you for watching. Again, my little thanks there. So my opinion on Halo 2. Halo 2 was supposed to be vastly different from what we saw at the E3 trailer. Or the E3 gameplay demo that they showed off where uh, basically Earth is under attack, they showed off board brutes coming out, being dropped down by phantoms, boarding stuff. It was kind of cool, and it was that one that ended with, bitch, you can't stick it. That that tr that little demo, demo was pretty freaking awesome. And so when Halo 2 came out, 
a lot of people were sitting there like, that's not what this was supposed to be. And, you know, I can agree with them, that's not what it was supposed to be. But I found the game fun. In fact, one of my favorite Halos, it got me into online gaming with Xbox Live. I played Halo 2 for like two or three years completely. So, I didn't even get into PC gaming until the end of 2006, and I was still playing Halo 2 then. And when Halo 3 came out, that's when I stopped playing Halo 2. I didn't have a 3, and I didn't get a 360 until last year, so... You know, I, I kinda had to stave myself off of Halo for a long time. But, uh... Yeah, if I, if I get my... When I get my capture card, I'm gonna be doing... I'm gonna be doing Halo Reach first, because that's gonna be a recent title, I wanna do that. And then I'll do Halo 3. I'm probably going to be doing co-op in both of these. And I'll also do Halo 3 ODST. I'm not too sure about Halo Wars. Because I, I personally didn't really enjoy Halo Wars. Because I'm, I like RTS games like StarCraft and whatnot. So to, ha to have like this really toned down RTS experience is not really that fun. I haven't even beaten it. I'm on the last level. I haven't even touched it in a long time. But, uh, yeah, I'll definitely be doing that. My next LP, I said this in the update I did a while ago, I'm going to be doing Fear 2. So expect to see that probably maybe this week or next week, depending on whenever this video was seen and whenever I upload it. But, um, yeah, that was, that was my uh, Halo 2 LP. Thanks for watching.